what's going on guys welcome back to the channel and for today i wanted to share some gameplay with you guys using magneto one of the best characters in this game and personally one of my favorite characters in any comic book series absolutely love magneto and he's a fantastic character in this game as you guys can see right now i actually have him built pretty well however if there's one character guys one character that's a mutant that's going to get a uniform from this update i really and truly hope that it is magneto even though magneto is a great character top tier character right now without a uniform i want a uniform for magneto and i know i'm not alone guys i'm sitting on over 4,000 bios for this man and literally every opportunity that i get i use those bios to throw them into tier 2 native to build them up but i still have so much so i definitely want a uniform for him because i want to push his rank and see how much further i can take this guy because he's an amazing character truly amazing character and as you guys can see right now i have him built very well overall the only thing that i'm really slacking on is his iso set this is what the build details look like on my magneto overall it's a solid build and i can get pretty much anything i want done with the character as you can see i have 118 for attack speed 75 percent for critical rate 175 for critical damage to be honest with you guys that's a little bit too low for my liking i would like that to be 190 minimum and i have 49 percent for ignore defense and 50 percent for reduced cooldown duration i think what i'm gonna do with my magneto is i'm actually going to take off a couple of the ignore defense defense ooze I have on him to try and lower it to about 42% because in the coming weeks I'm going to be changing up my cards again and I'm probably going to be getting around 8% ignore defense and then I want him to be well over the cap for ignore defense while having such low critical damage it's not super low but i would like it to be anywhere from 185 to 190 so i think that's what i'm gonna be doing with my magneto because i think i have about eight ignore defense who's on this man as you guys can see right here i have two energy attack two ignore defense on this slot i have two energy attack one critical damage one ignore defense right here i have two energy attack one critical damage, one ignore defense. So I can definitely put a lot more critical damage ooze on this guy. And this last slot right here, I have two energy attack and two critical damage. As for his skills, as you guys can see, everything is at six. And the rotation I like to use with my Magneto is actually to open with the four for that guard and the iframe, and then go into the five for the five skill buff. And this skill is actually amazing because it will lock down the enemy because of how fast and consecutive it actually hits them with these cars and pillars and anything else magneto feels like it it's a great skill it kind of reminds me of something like quicksilvers however it doesn't attack as fast and it's not as effective as quicksilvers but it's pretty damn good after that i like to go into the three then the two then the one and after that the fight is pretty much over they can't do anything they're just getting guard broken and they're getting hit from all angles magneto is an absolute beast i really hope he gets a uniform that makes it so that he deals more damage like faster that's the only downside of magneto he deals a lot of damage but he deals it over time he's a dot character he's not a burst character and that's the only flaw with the character it's not even a flaw it's just that the way this game is designed right now is designed in a way where the faster you can clear something the better the character is judged by the community magneto still an amazing character and one that i would like to have in the top 100 in the ranking he's one of the only characters that i actually care about his rank so eventually i'm going to come back and give him some better urus and awaken this hopefully he gets a uniform in his update that would be great i'm running power Fangry hulk and that's simply to give him some more attack speed he doesn't get enough natively for me so that's why i wanted to give him power of angry hulk but if you get overdrive that is amazing too as for the obelisk, i decided to go defensively give him some max hp some critical rate and invincibility in hindsight this is not the best for him since invincibility is not that great anymore but at the time this was very very good and it made him damn near unkillable for stuff like conquest in the long term though i'm probably going to give him something like a ctp of patience if i ever see one but with that said let's actually jump into shadowland guys and have some fun i absolutely hate this iron fist boss so i take every opportunity to stunt on this guy and actually annihilate him and that's what i'm going to be doing today with my magneto
at all especially since i don't have a damage proc on this guy what did we get oh uh, come on i was really hoping for a six star iso since he was the featured boss of the day but whatever magneto got it done guys a minute 37 definitely not a bad clear time in my opinion but let me know what your guys thoughts are on magneto if you have them built let me know some of the things you guys have been able to do with your own magneto till next time boys peace out